Hi, I'm Crow, and welcome to Driftwood Hollow Drums. I'm making a little video today to demonstrate the sound of this beautiful shamanic drum here. Now this drum is currently for sale on our Etsy shop, so this video is to accompany that listing to enable you to have a little listen to the sound of the drum. Uh, it's very difficult buying online, and I do appreciate, so these, these videos that I make are just to give you a more, probably fuller picture, more informed uh, choice that you're able to make then. So this is a, a buffalo skin drum, uh, so it's a buffalo head, it's on an oak frame. If I flip her over, you can see we've got a, a branch handle. Now I'm not 100% sure of the species of wood of this branch, it was foraged from the woods here, uh, you know, several several years ago. It's well seasoned, it's been in my workshop, uh, waiting for its drum. Uh, and this is the drum that it belongs to, so that's beautiful. It's been laced with artificial sinew. Uh, which is really strong and is also uh, it's good for resisting the effects of moisture. It doesn't, it's not affected by moisture, so it will stay at its true tension, unlike skin lacing. So on the inside of the frame here, I've burnt driftwood hollow drums with my little laser engraver, and that's to give you, that's my maker's mark, so you'll always know who the drum was made by, or birthed by. Uh, and on the other side here, I put burst on the 24th of February 2021. So that's a birth date, and that's to enable you to look at the astrological aspects of the drum. Uh, create a birth chart, find out where the planets were, what influences were around at the time when the drum was birthed. So if that's your bag, then that will be interesting for you as well. And if it's not, maybe it will encourage you to look into that uh, astrological side of life. So on the handle here, you can notice, I'm sure, that we have a fur... Uh, wrapping on the branch handle here for comfort and for trim and for energetic purposes also. Now this is rabbit skin uh, and rabbit fur, so the, the energy of the rabbit coming in to the drum as well, as well as looking very beautiful and pretty. So I'm going to play with two beaters, one's a firm beater, one's a soft beater. Both give a slightly different sound, so you'll hopefully be able to discern the difference between the two. And if you decide to purchase the drum, there's an option to buy either one or both of these if you choose to. Uh, I'll start with a soft beater, I think. And we'll give a little, a little demo. Here we go. So we're going to go and have a look and see what he's barking at. Okay, so yes, the dog was barking at a delivery person. Uh, so that noise has now subsided. I'm going to play again. So it's been about five or ten minutes and it's interesting because it's quite damp. Uh, under the trees here and it has been a bit misty and raining this morning so it'll be interesting to see whether the tone of the drum has now dropped so uh, and as it's absorbed moisture hopefully it hasn't dropped too much it might have dropped a little bit so I'll just give a very brief little play here we go
beautiful. I'm not sure, actually. I'd have to watch the video back whether it's dropped in tone or not. It might have done a very slight amount. But anyway, I hope this has helped uh, when making your decision on which drum is right for you. Uh, I'm Crow. It's been Driftwood Hollow Drums. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.